Welcome to the LiveOddsAndScores.com betting preview of the FA Cup semi-final between Liverpool and Everton, which is being played on Saturday at 12.30. And the first thing I would say, George, is why on earth are they playing this game on Saturday? The most important thing for anybody who's, who lives in Liverpool is the Grand National, <laughs> which is you know, 4.15. They're all going to be on their coaches on the way back. Why didn't this, they play this game on Sunday evening and have Spurs versus Chelsea now? Anyway, rant over. What do you make of the game? Yeah, I know. I mean, I think we're all going to be tuned into the Grand National, but um, I, I think Everton, Everton might be the value bet. Everton have have the have again have the momentum. I mean, Liverpool. There's a lot of hype around Liverpool saying this is still where we can win. We've already gone and won the Cullen Cup. We're going to get the FA Cup as well. They they know they can't get Europe they, in in any sense. They won't even get the Europa League. So I think this they will have all their energy thrown into this. Meanwhile, Everton. Doing very well in the league, slightly happier with where they are, but Everton, Everton are form. Everton are the form team. I cannot understand the, the betting. I mean, I think the betting is entirely on reputation. You've got Liverpool at eight to five, got Everton at eleven to five. I mean, if you if you came, if you landed from Mars and looked at this game on on the basis of form, Everton would be the favourite. Yeah, you'd be smashing Everton. They, they, they they've been winning away from from home. Uh, Eleven to five is a, a, a massive price, and they're and they any time goal scorer markets as well. I know, I, I know, I like them, but Anna kb has been scoring for fun. Seven to two with Paddy Power is a great price. You got Suarez priced up at two to one with Sporting Bet, and you got Carroll thirteen to five with Paddy Power. Th these are players out of form. I know Carroll scored the winner the other day, but they, they, not, neither of those players have been scoring scoring this season. Anna kb has been scoring for fun. So is Jelovic, who's five to two with Paddy Power. Why they're longer than than the Liverpool players, I just don't know, and I and I think they're bets. Yeah, I mean the only thing I would say about the first goal scorer markets is that, given that these games are usually low scoring, the, the FA Cup semi finals at Wembley are often low scoring. That uh, that's always my concern about the, the goal scorer markets, the any time goal scorer markets. Um, my my personal view is on on a low scorer that gives that brings in uh, on the Asian handicap mm -hmm. betting. You can net bet Everton with a quarter goal start at four to five with Bet Victor. I think that's fantastic because you you win half your money if there's a draw. And I I personally would make Everton slight favourites. So with a quarter goal start, I think that's very generous. I think it's very generous. And you say that there are many goals, but both both teams have, been, have actually just found a bit of scoring form recently and. I'm not talking about the teams, I'm just talking about the Wembley situation is that these semi-finals tend to be cagey, it means so much to both teams yeah, yeah, yeah. that yeah. They, you, you just don't want to go out and concede, you don't want to be 2-0 down at half-time yeah. uh, and so as a result you end up with the game being quite closed and then it opens up at about in the 60th minute yeah, exactly. and everybody yeah. goes for it but unless there's an early goal for one of the teams it, it can be very very cagey. Yeah, I see. I and, and I, I I would agree that I think that's represented in the price. It's three to four. Stan James. I I don't think there's value in that. I think that's too short for me. I wouldn't I wouldn't be back in the under two and a half goals. But Everton eleven to five bet Victor. I I think I I'm I'm happy with that bigger price. I mean obviously four to five plus of course is yeah. cracking price as well. But I, I just think bet Victor overpriced. Everton this week. Okay, well I'm taking the 4-5 to five plus quarter goal Everton. You and I'm to... just going to crack into Everton 11-5. to five. Great. Thanks very much for watching and keep checking back at liveoddsandscores.com for more betting previews. Cheers.